Hi, Dyslexic Genius here, Brad Hurt. My phone number is 864-236-1680, or you can email me at dyslexicgeniushurt at gmail.com. What I'm going to talk about is repainting a brass bell horn like this, Victor horn like this. And these are extremely labor intensive. First you have to strip everything off, and then you what you have to do first before painting is you have to polish the bell out. And when you start to polish the bell on brass bells, you're going to find every little boo-boo in the brass that you can see. Even when you strip, you're going to see all the dents and dings in the steel part of the horn also. It really comes out. These are a lot harder than a paneled horn. The reason you polish the bell out first is how are you going to polish the bell out after you've painted it and not hurt the paint, the black part right here. So what I've done is I've polished everything out on both sides. Then I take my blue painter's tape in a razor blade and I gently tape all the way around here because there's a bead right here. And then you take your razor blade and you stick it in here like that and you gently cut the paint out, I mean the tape out. The inside of the bells are much easier because you have the reverse of the bead which is like this seam here when they sheet metal this together, you have this little line right there. Are you going to protect that bell somehow before you paint? Oh yeah, I'll cover all this with paper. And you have that little indention right here. So you tape everything out and then you cover the bell and everything with paper or newspaper or whatever you want to use. I also also run fresh paper on the workbench before I start painting. On this, you're going to have to shoot the inside first and the outside last. That way when you have it here and you're painting, the inside's drying also and you can just walk away. You know, this is a lot of fun. This one gets a little technical and that's my tip for the day.